in this video, let's create a timer to drive the snake. Okay. So how to create a timer? Mm, let's Google it. So Java timer example stack overflow. Yeah, how to set a timer in Java. So basically, so to run the task once, we you would do to have the task repeat after duration, you would do. Okay, so this is what we need. Okay. We can put the code here. So let's define the timer like that. Timer, okay. So timer, time, oh, let's import this one. Yeah. Timer equals new timer. Timer dot schedule at rate, right? Schedule at a fixed rate. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. So task new timer task. Yes. Wow, so cool. this we can put our uh, task job right task code here so first time mm, first time and the period uh, oh i guess the unit is minute second so two seconds is like that okay let's use two second uh, so two mm -hmm. Two, that's two minute. We don't want that, so let's try two second to see. Two second. Let's put a print to test. Um, timer is ticking. Dot dot dot. Okay, let's run it. Two seconds. Yes. Yes. Okay, now we can put a real thing there. Stop it. What's the real thing? Let's move down, okay? So, move down the snake. BRD dot move, move left or move down, move, move, uh, move left. Okay, let's try move left. And I guess we still need to repaint, right? Mm -hmm. No, so not here. Make oh, let's make a copy like that. So make it shorter, the time period, one second, one second. So try it. Wow, wow, okay. Now we need to change the function of each button, right? To change its, um, to change the direction of the moving. Okay, so let's create a variable here to represent the direction of uh, the snake. Mm. Can we put it here? board 
Okay. So let's could put a direction here. Um, let's create an enum for the direction. Okay. So what is enum? Let's Google an enum. So Java enum example stack overflow. Yeah. Understanding enum in Java stack overflow. Yeah, this one is newer. Let's take a look at this first. So public enum like that. Okay, so we can create four directions here, right? like uh, up and down left right so okay let's define it now here because we can define it now here I guess e in is there anything here? okay in direction Let's use capitalize left. So right, up, and down. And yeah. So can we use it here? Mm. So let's define the direction here. Mm. So direct direction, yeah. So direction equals yeah. The original one equals um, direction dot left that's um, let's move down okay at the beginning yeah so when we we can delete this one now okay move left yeah we cannot move left blindly that it should be based on the um, the directions can we switch that switch key direction mm. no so let's check Java in um, for switch case do we have like a stack overflow yeah java using in now with a switch statement uh, let's give it a try can we use that Enum switch which view which view dot values okay so we should be able to use yeah we can use the enum uh, variable in the switch structure so what's the value mm. So the first one is left, yes, and case, wow, that's annoying, we don't need that, we can just 
So switch that one. Let's make a copy of that, that, that. So left, right, and put a break here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Left, right, okay, up, and uh, down. So now we, if it's left, we'll move left, right? And uh, if it's right, we'll move right. Right. Okay. Up. Down. Yes. Move down. So the timer will drive the snake, right? Based on its moving direction. And uh, so here, the button function should be changed to like modifying, right? Its direction. So we don't need that. Direction equals, um, what's this? This is left, okay, so it's left. Oh, direction to left. What? What's wrong with that? What does it can bring? Local variable direction defined in an enclosing scope must be final or effectively final. Okay, so um, this cannot be final. I guess it's the same complaint, right? Cannot see the error message. What about this one? Occurrence local variable definition direction defined in the enclosing must be final or effectively final. Um, one way to do that is we can move out this one uh, and put it here. And uh, direction, what does it complain now? Static, yeah, change that to static. That's okay, static. Oh, now everyone is happy, cool. So we just move out this, right? So there's advanced uh, concept here, but we don't don't worry about that for now. We'll explain that later. So as long as it works for us, it's okay. So we change the yeah the direction to left. Now for this one, it should be up. Okay, up. This one is down. The last one, right. We change the direction to right. Now, yeah, here there's a repaint. Let's give it a try. Run it. Going down. Go to right. Yes. Too slow. Let's speed up a little bit. So 
is the timer. Oh, let's make this one clean up here. So where is our time timer? Yeah, here. So let's put 0 0.5 here to speed up, double the speed. 0 0.5, save, run. Oh, what? What's wrong with this one? What did I do? Undo, 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 undo. Compile. Save. So it means we cannot use decimal number here. Is that true? Oh, okay, that's fine. Because we can just change this to 500, right? Not big deal. And uh, 500 here. Now let's try. Oh, it's much faster. So go to right, up. We want to eat the fruit right so go left go down is it longer yes right wow it takes a while to approach the fruit going down or oh, too late left and down okay right and down no right and up wow left yes so is it longer okay cool that's it for today see you next time